بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ماي نيم از محمود صلاح اي ام تشيف اوف فاسكولار سيرجري في ان ذا سعودي جيرمان هوسبيتالز جروب اي واز اسكت تو تشوز ون اوف ذا سبجكتس اي تشوز اكشولي ا سبجكت ويتش از كونسيدر فيري امبورتانت سبجكت ويتش از diabetic foot because I'm sure that we all in all specialities we see this uh, uh, patients having problems in the foot uh, and I'm sure that we all have seen the, the complications that can happen uh, for diabetic foot ending by amputation and I have seen a lot a lot of patients starting with very simple problem in the nail bed for example and ending by major uh, amputations uh, the problem i'm a vascular surgeon and i receive referrals from uh, different specialities the problem that i receive very late uh, referrals i receive patients who had gangrene of one toe which was amputated and then another toe which was amputated and the third toe and there was mid-tarsal amputation and then they discovered that there is a vascular problem and they refer him to the vascular surgeon. This is very late. Uh, so I, I urge every patient, especially our brothers and sisters in the internal medicine, in the family medicine, in the general practitioners, which I consider the front liners of the diabetic uh, patients. I know that uh, as a diabetician, you have a lot to take care about the uh, blood sugar level, the insulin dosage, uh, the blood tests, but please do not forget to put your hands on the pulses on the foot. Maybe the patient is not complaining of anything in the foot but this is the golden area if we picked up uh, a patient without uh, pulses in the foot without having any problems still this is the golden area to treat this patient if we wait till he starts to have some color changes or some uh, gangrenous patches or something like that uh, the more we wait, the less the result will be. So this is the uh, major point I want to uh, emphasize. Please check the pulses of the foot, even if the patient is not complaining of anything in the foot. If you did not feel the pulses, please refer the patient to the vascular surgeon. Number two, when I receive the patient, what we will do, number one, we have to evaluate the whole vascular system in the lower limbs. The easiest way is Doppler. Doppler will give us a very uh, good information. If there is something major in the Doppler, we should step uh, uh, a little bit higher to do CT uh, angiography. Uh, then we decide if the patient has vascular problem. So we either we will go for angioplasty, which is now becoming number one option for treatment of vascular uh, problem. Uh, angioplasty could be just balloon angioplasty or stent angioplasty according to the situation. If something is more complicated, we may need uh, surgery, but the whole issue that we need to refer the patient a little bit early so the patient will have higher uh, chance for cure. Thank you very much.